<laughs> What's up, YouTube? Cool story, bro, about the second, 60 second, 60 second narrative Pokemon showdown battle. And, hey, look, it's not you, you. How about it? So, this is an OU battle. This is against Warp Rat. He asked me if we could have another battle in OU, and I was like, all right, sure, absolutely. I've, uh, I've been messing around a bit myself in OU, preferably as of late, because I kind of have been chewing it in UU and not been feeling it as of late. And here we are. Like, this is an older OU team of mine I've actually had for a couple months now, actually. But my team, l let me explain it right quick. Let me give you the rundown. You know, this team was built around the core of Conkledur and Reuniclus. Bulk up Conkledur with Guts. Trick Room Reuniclus with three attacks and leftovers. Uh, especially defensive Heat Ran. He sets up rocks and has generally decent synergy. It's mainly because I needed a check against Sun. Because Sun teams are kind of a nuisance. Well, mainly Venusaur and Volcarona to an extent. But mainly Venusaur. Um, Tyranitar's Choice Band sets up Sand for me. It does pretty good work. Rotom Wash is on like every single OU team I have. Gotta keep my clothes clean, man. Gotta keep them clean. Now, this last slot, for those of you who don't know, Sand Slash is my favorite Pokemon. My favorite Pokemon of all time. Now, this used to be a Choice Scarf, Sand Force, Landorus, Landorus Incarnate. But ever since Landorus Incarnate got banned, I'm not sure whether to be happy or not about it. But that battle I had with, um, with Kingler... One, two, three, four, five kind of made me wish it was banned at that time. But anyway, Landorus was banned, so I needed a better revenge killer in Sand, and I could have used Stoutland, but screw Stoutland, man. We got Sand Slash. I have no better excuse than right now to use my favorite Pokemon. So here it is, Sand Slash. His team, hmm, actually, did, was this the team he used against me? I know he had a Breloom before. Nah, it wasn't the same team. It wasn't the same team. He's got a massive fighting weakness, though. And, like, barely any checks to it at all. But, I mean, so Conqueror could definitely put in work against this guy's team. Uh, he's got Dawnfin instead of Rocks and Spin. Blissey's a special wall. I'm not sure what his physical wall is. <laughs> Cloyster is Cloyster. Terrakion is Terrakion. Uh, Breloom is Breloom. And Alakazam uh, most likely is a Focus Sash. But enough of that. I guess uh, let's begin, shall we? So he leads off with his Dawnfin in turn one. I lead off with Flood. And he switches straight out, goes in the cloister. I go for the Will-O-Wisp on it because I just wanted to break his sturdy. Because that's all I really wanted to do. I Will-O-Wisp it. I'm surprised to outspeed his cloister as I go for the Volt Switch. And I go straight to Moses. So turn one and it's already looking grim. It's already looking grim. Like, cloister is a non-issue right now. So I mock Punch. I would have let cloister die personally. Because if Alakazam had the Focus Sash, he just lost it right there. So, I'm not sure why he focus blasted. He's predicting Tyranitar, no doubt. But eh, he goes for Psychic on me. And since I'm specially defensive Rotom, I can actually take it even after the minus one. Volt switch back out, bring in Reptar, despite the focus blast. And he switches out anyway. <laughs> and I just double switch back into Reuniclus. Because I really just wanted to lure the focus blast out of him. But this works too, I guess. So. He goes for Earthquake with his Dawn Fan. I go for Side Shock. It did more than I was comfortable with. So, I switch Rotom back in because it kind of walls Dawn Fan for the most part. He goes for the Ice Shard. Doesn't do much. I Pain Split. Take all that health right back. So, he has to switch now or let something suffer. And he switches back in his Alakazam to take the Hydro Pump. And Alakazam dies, which is kind of unfortunate. Kind of unfortunate. He brings in Breloom. And I'm surprised I'll speed as I go for the Will-O-Wisp. The ironic part is Breloom is actually a huge threat to my team. Like, a massive threat to my team. Because no one on my team wants to get Sport. No one on my team wants to take Breloom's stat moves at plus two. You know what I'm saying? But here we are with a burnt Breloom who didn't use Sport, surprisingly. So Breloom's burnt in Sand. He's got Leftovers. I'm not sure why you'd run Leftovers Breloom if you're not going to run Poison Hill. But, eh, whatever. I bring in Cold Tran, because everybody wants to see the Tran, baby. And I go for the Lava Plume. He switches in Dawn Fan. He, uh, I outspeed and kill off his Dawn Fan. He goes for the Stone Edge on me. I'm not sure why. I would have went for the close, close Combat, because really, the only thing that could take it is Conquer Dirt. And, I mean, the only, I mean, no, nothing on my team could really minds. Nothing on my team would like taking the Close Combat, for real, for real. 
except Reuniclus. And if Reuniclus comes out, you could just kill it with stone. That's an arranged set. But it went. It, but that's how it went, I guess. So here we are now, bringing in jelly beans. You know, I, I forget why I switched out Sand Slash. I, I wasn't paying attention actually. But um, uh, Psy Shock is Blissey. Holy crap! It does that much. I wasn't ready for that. I know Blissey's physical defense stat is like abysmally weak. But I didn't think it would almost one hit KO of Blissey from full HP. I wasn't ready for that. I was like, holy crap. Holy crap. So, yeah, Psy Shock is Breloom. That thing dies off, and he's got none left with Cloyster. I wanted to finish the game with Sand Slash because that's how I like finishing these games off. It's with my favorite Pokemon, but this is cool too. So, I have Jelly Beans finish off his Cloyster with a Psy Shock, and that is good game Warp Rat. Um, he has a YouTube that he just recently made or remade or something and so I'm gonna put his link to his channel in the description for the video so yeah go subscribe him man and thank you guys for watching like comment subscribe and favorite if you want to see Brobat make more teams winning with Sand Slash or something yeah